Dextromethorphan is one of the well-known medication which is used as cough suppressant. Interestingly, this medication can be used for the treatment of depression. For this purpose, Dextromethorphan can be combined with another medication, Bupropion. Bupropion is one of the atypical antidepressant which is also used to treat depression. However, it can be combined with Dextromethorphan in the management of depressive disorder. Interestingly, in this combination, the antidepressant activity is mainly shown by Dextromethorphan. And here, Bupropion is going to increase the bioavailability of Dextromethorphan which relieves the symptoms of depression. For this purpose, Dextromethorphan can be used at a dose of 45 mg which is combined with Bupropion at a dose of 105 mg. This fixed combination is having few of the advantages. Particularly, this combination is fast acting. Dextromethorphan and Bupropion combination can relieve the symptoms of depression within one month and they can reduce the levels of monoamines within one month. Second advantage is that this combination is available as a tablet for oral route. And third, this combination has less side effects compared with individual agents. So today in this video, we are going to discuss this combination Dextromethorphan plus Bupropion, how this combination acts, how it works, what is the doses, what are the important side effects and precautions, all these things we will discuss in this video. First of all, let us see how it works. This is the presynaptic nerve terminal which stores the excitatory neurotransmitter glutamate. And this is the postsynaptic neuron which is expressed with glutamate receptors like NMDA receptors. When these receptors are activated, it results in the excitation. However, in the people with depression, enhanced NMDA activity is observed and here dextromethorphan can block this NMDA activity and it acts as an antagonist at NMDA receptors. This reduces the glutamate mediated excitation and relieves the symptoms of depression. Dextromethorphan can also act by another mechanism. This is a presynaptic nerve terminal storing monoamines like norepinephrine or 5-HT. When these monoamines are released, they can activate the postsynaptic neurons. However, the released monoamines can be taken back into the nerve terminal by their uptake transporters. In the people with depression, these monoamine levels are reduced in the CNS. Now, dextromethorphan can act as an agonist on sigma-1 receptors. This blocks the uptake of monoamines into the nerve terminal, which improves the symptoms of depression. However, the action of dextromethorphan is limited by its metabolism and it is going to be converted into metabolites by cytochrome P450 system. Among these, CYP2D6 is one of the important enzyme that is responsible for metabolism of dextromethorphan. Now, bupropion can be combined with dextromethorphan as this medication can block the CYP2D6 activity, thereby can reduce the metabolism of dextromethorphan. This improves the levels of dextromethorphan in the body, which acts as antidepressant. Even though bupropion can show its antidepressant activity, it is mainly intended to increase the activity of dextromethorphan to relieve the symptoms of depression. Now let us the side effects of this combination. This combination produces one of the important side effects, dizziness, and it also produces somnolence, the sleepiness in the people. Other side effects like headache and diarrhea can also be observed. With continuous use of this medication, it can produce excessive sweating as well as dry mouth in the people, and a loss of appetite can also be observed. And a few people may observe insomnia, disturbance in the sleep. Now let us the precautions of this combination. Bupropion and dextromethorphan combination can produce some dizziness in the people. This may increase the risk of falls because of lightheadedness. Therefore, when taking this combination, caution should be taken during the initial days of therapy. However, this side effect may be slowly disappeared on prolonged use of this combination. Bupropion can increase the blood pressure in the people. This is particularly observed when it is combined with other medications that may increase the levels of monoamines like norepinephrine. So with increased levels of norepinephrine, blood pressure is going to be increased due to vasoconstriction of blood vessels. Therefore, in the people with pre-existing hypertension, this combination should be carefully used. Another important effect of bupropion and dextromethorphan combination is on the serotonin levels. Both of these medications can increase the serotonin levels, but it may be within the limits. However, when they are combined with other medications that also increase serotonin levels, 
such as SSRIs or SNRIs, then this combination can produce a serious effect serotonin syndrome. It is one of the condition of increased muscle rigidity, high body temperature, palpitations, tachycardia and excessive sweating and tremor can be observed. So dextromethorphan bupropion combination should be carefully used with other medications that increase serotonin levels. And if these symptoms are observed, then immediately the drug should be stopped. Bupropion can increase the risk of seizures. It can reduce the threshold potential for induction of seizures. However, this effect can be observed at higher dose of bupropion. When this medication is used greater than 300 mg dose per day, the risk of seizures can be more pronounced. Since this combination used at lower doses, the risk of seizures is less. But any other coexisting factors or previous history of seizures may increase the risk. Now let us the contraindications of this combination. Bupropion dextromethorphan combination is contraindicated in people with seizure disorders. Since bupropion can increase the risk of seizures in the people with pre-existing seizure disorders, this combination should not be used. Similarly, in the people with neuronal disorders like bulimia nervosa, which results in the increased appetite, Again, this combination is not recommended because in such people, this combination can increase the risk of seizures. Similarly, in the people with sudden withdrawal of alcohol, benzodiazepines or antiepileptics, the risk of seizures are more pronounced with this combination. Now, let us see the doses of this combination. Already we have seen that dextromethorphan and bupropion combination is available as an oral tablets and here dextromethorphan is used at a dose of 45 mg and bupropion at 105 mg. So each tablet contains 45 mg of dextromethorphan combined with 105 mg of bupropion. This combination should be started at a low dose initially. So the initial dose is only one tablet given once daily. However, after three days where the body slowly adjusts to this medication and dizziness is controlled, then the dose can be increased to a target dose of two tablets given as divided doses. So it can be given each tablet twice daily at an interval of eight hours. At this dose, this combination can relieve the symptoms of depression by increasing the levels of monoamines within the brain. So that's all about this combination, dextromethorphan and bupropion. This combination is having several advantages as it is fast acting and it is having low side effect profile and it is suitable for oral administration. This combination can be used to relieve the symptoms of depression without producing any troublesome side effects. In this combination, dextromethorphan mainly relieves the symptoms of depression where bupropion is added to inhibit the absorption of dextromethorphan and increase its bioavailability. Dizziness is one of the important side effects produced by this combination. And bupropion can increase the risk of seizures. So in the people with previous history of seizures, this combination should not be used. So that's all about this combination, dextromethorphan and bupropion. That's for today. I hope this video is useful to you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.